One of the more annoying things about Adobe Illustrator, especially if you work with lasers and CNCs, is the way you have to handle line art, and you can't layer it. But I've figured out a way to do it, and I'm going to show it to you right now. For this example, we're going to start with these two images of a peach. Now, both of these are line art, and if you see, if I take the one that I want in the front, it's going to overlap, but you can see what's underneath. And that's because this one has no fill around it in any way. You can kind of see it. If I drag it up here, you can see, you can see straight through to the background here. So there's no fill on this. So how do you make it so that you can overlap these two and obscure what's actually behind it? Let me show you. You're going to highlight this one, hit control C, and then control V. Now you have an exact copy. With that exact copy, you're going to right click and click release compound path. And you're going to see you now have a solid one. If you go over to Pathfinder and click Unite, now you just have the shape. This is exactly what you want. Now, from your color picker, with the shape selected, you're going to select white and no outline stroke. And you're going to see this is the same shape but white. And if I take these two things and put them together, which we can just cheat a little bit and just select everything, and we can go over to Horizontal Align Center, click there, Horizontal Align Vertical, click there. And if you notice, they all it looks like it's the same as it was. We're going to pick both of the layers. Remember, there are two layers here. We're going to hit Control G to group them. And now, if you come over here, you notice you can now layer them on top of each other. Now, for most cases, if you're just doing print work, this is good enough. But if you're doing CNC or laser work, there's one more step you have to do. Because if you notice, as I come over here, you can actually see the artwork underneath. But we want this to be one piece of art. I'm going to highlight both pieces, and we are going to click Merge on the Pathfinder. And as you see, now we have one piece of art where everything is all together, and your CNC or your laser will have no trouble cutting this out. Well, I hope that tutorial was helpful for you. I spent a lot of time trying to figure that out because I do a lot of laser and CNC stuff, and this has been a recurring pain every single time I've had to work with line art. So I figured this out, and I figured it was valuable enough to share it out with you. Hope you liked the video. If you do, don't forget to click the like button. Of course, subscribe. Leave a comment if this helped you out. I'd love to know if you'd like to see more of these tutorials, and I'll catch you in the next video.